So after round one, only eight teams are left standing. Golden State will go up against OKC, Houston against Utah, Toronto against Orlando, and Atlanta against Philadelphia. Are your predictions still right? Stay tuned to find out. And so it looks like the Houston Rockets will be the first team to advance to the conference finals, sweeping the Utah Jazz in four games. Donovan Mitchell will be bringing up the ball for the final time this season. And Houston will be advancing to the second round of the NBA playoffs. And it is a tight game here in Toronto as the Orlando Magic need to win this game in order to advance to the second round of the NBA playoffs. Terrence Russ has the ball. Aaron Gordon trying to set the screen. Terrence Russ trying to drive in. Gives it out to Aaron Gordon who shoots a three. And he puts it in with three with 25 seconds left on the clock. He puts up the Orlando Magic up by three. Toronto takes a timeout. Orlando is hyped up right now. Player of the game is Aaron Gordon with 10 points. 3 of 7 from field goal range. He is the same guy that just switched that 3 pointer. Raptors take another timeout. Twenty-five seconds left on the clock. Toronto is down by three as Orlando must win this game in order to advance to the second round. Or the conference finals. <laughs> Sorry. Gives it to Kyle Lowry and the Raptors take their final timeout here. Or to advance to the conference finals. Siakam will inbound the ball again. Gets it to Kyle Lowry, who's guarded by DJ Augustine. Gives it inside to Leonard. Gives it back inside to Leonard. Oh, I thought he was going to fade it there. 13 seconds on the clock. Kyle Lowry with the ball. Shoots a three. It is no good as Nikola Vucevic rebounds the ball. And I believe that will decide the game right there. As Kawhi Leonard will foul and put... Jonathan Isaac to the line for two shots with five seconds left on the clock. The first shot is good putting the Orlando Magic up by four Second one is also good putting the Magic up by five And Kyle Lowry will take up the ball for the last time this season as the Orlando Magic win this game 19 to 14 and they will move on to the conference finals and the 76ers will win this game 25 to 16 and they will move on to the conference finals to match up against the Orlando Magic to compete for a spot in the NBA championship. And in the first game seven of the simulation, the OKC Thunder will fall to the Golden State Warriors losing this game. 22 to 18 as the Golden State Warriors will go to the conference finals and match up against the Houston Rockets for a spot in the NBA finals. So after two rounds, only four teams are left standing. The Golden State Warriors will match up against the Houston Rockets and in the East, the Orlando Magic will match up against the Philadelphia 76ers. Hopefully you have chosen one of these teams to go at least this far and hopefully whatever you pick is going to be right and let's get into these conference finals. And so here in uh, Houston, yes, 
uh, the Golden State Warriors will win this game and move on to yet again another NBA Finals spot as Kevin Durant will go to the line for two shots. First one is good, putting up the Golden State Warriors by six. Three seconds left in this game. Second second shot is also good. Timeout by the Rockets. Player of the game is the Marcus Cousins. Three points, 50 field goal range. Chris will be inbounding the ball. Gives it to Ennis, gives it to Tucker, gives it back to Ennis. The shot is no good, and the Warriors will go on to yet again another NBA Finals spot. And it is a tied game seven here in Orlando as Philadelphia and Orlando are tied with 15 points each. Either team that wins will go to the NBA Finals. Joel Embiid going in, slamming that basketball. Timeout by the Magic. Thirty-five seconds left on the clock. Philadelphia is up by two. Player of the game is JJ Redick, six points. Augustine has the ball. 32 seconds left on the clock. Then inside to Nikola Vucevic who breaks it off the backboard and banks it into the basket. 17 points for each team. Philadelphia takes a timeout. 27 seconds left on the clock. The game is tied 17 to 17. Wilson Chandler will be inbounding the ball for the 76ers. Gives it to JJ Redick. Whoever wins this game will go and match up against the Golden State Warriors. JJ Redick with the ball defended by DJ Augustine. 11 seconds left on the clock. 10 seconds, 9. 4 seconds left on the shot clock. Gets it to Embiid inside. Fade away. It is good. 3 seconds left on the clock. Joel Embiid puts the Philadelphia 76ers up by two. Orlando takes their final timeout here. Let's see if they can find a way to shoot or score a three and hopefully find a way to go on to the NBA Finals to play the Golden State Warriors. Isaac inbounding the ball. Three seconds left on the clock. Gives it to DJ Augustine in the corner. Shoots it. Blocked by Ben Simmons. And the Philadelphia 76ers will go on to the NBA Finals. And match up against the Golden State Warriors. This will be a fun matchup to see. And so after three rounds. Only two teams are left standing. They are the Golden State Warriors from the West and the Philadelphia 76ers from the East. This is an interesting play finals matchup. Let's see who wins. Game one, Golden State. Game two goes to the 76ers. Game three goes to the Warriors. Game four goes to the 76ers. Tied series. And the Warriors have game th five. Yeah. Let's see if they can pull out the win. Game six goes to the Philadelphia 76ers. And it is a close game here in Golden State as Philadelphia is up by only three points. Ben Simmons has the ball. Gives it time to Joel Embiid. Puts it up and gets the and one as DeMarcus Cousins fouls Joel Embiid and puts him to the line for one shot. The shot is good. Joel Embiid puts the 76ers up by six points with 42 seconds left in this game. Golden State 
takes a time out. Y'all 76ers fans have been trusting the process and that process seems to be coming alive right now. Joel Embiid is the player of the game. 8 points, 3 of 5 from field goal range. Draymond Green will be inbounding the ball for the Warriors. Gives it to Clay Thompson in the corner. Gives it to Kevin Durant. Gives it to Draymond Green. Gives it to Clay. Gives it to Steph. Jamarcus trying to set a screen for Clay. JJ Redick on Clay Thompson. Fade away. It is good as Clay Thompson only makes a deficit four points. TJ McConnell has the ball, and the Warriors will start fouling intentionally now as they need to stop the clock in order to try and win this game. TJ McConnell is at the line for two shots. The first shot is good. The second shot is also good. The lead is now back to six points. 25 seconds left in this game. It is a game seven, and this has been a very interesting series. Draymond Green will be inbounding the ball for the Warriors yet again. Kevin Durant sets the screen. Looking for someone to pass to. Gives it to Curry in the corner. Gonna have to shoot a three here, I think. Oh, he's gonna drive inside with the floater, and he banks it off the backboard, making the lead only Four points, and they will foul yet again intentionally and put TJ McConnell to the line again for two shots. First shot is good. Second shot is also good. Warriors take their final timeout of this game. 18 seconds left in this game. Philadelphia is up by six points in this game seven. Draymond Green will be inbounding the ball again. Steph Curry has the ball. 16 seconds left on the clock. Draymond Green with the screen. It's Curry with the pull up three. It is good. Curry makes a deficit only three points as they will foul yet again intentionally. Play Thompson this time fouling JJ Redick as he will be put to the line for two shots. Probably one of the most like. I don't know. These are the most important free throws of his life. First three throw is good. 12 seconds left on the clock. Second shot is also good. Making the lead five points. Steph Curry brings up the ball. Gives it to Clay Thompson. Gives it inside to Draymond Green. Gives it back outside to Durant. Curry with the three. It is good. Making the lead only two points now. The 76ers take a timeout here. Three seconds left on the clock here. Golden State is down by two in this game seven. Joel Embiid will be inbounding the ball. Gets it to TJ McConnell and Steph Curry will foul intentionally yet again, hoping he will miss a shot. One second left on the clock. First shot is good, making it a three-point lead. Second shot is also good. And that, ladies and gentlemen, will make the Philadelphia 76ers winners of this 2K simulation. Whoever thought that this would happen? The Philadelphia 76ers. Beating the Golden State Warriors in seven games to win this simulation. They just trust the process, I guess. That's all I gotta say. So as you can see here, ladies and gentlemen, the Philadelphia 76ers did win this simulation, beating the Golden State Warriors in seven games. 
the MVP was Joel Embiid. Guys, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. Turn on those post notifications so you are notified whenever I post a new video. Guys, thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it just as much as I did. And make sure you tune in to the next video, which will be another 2K video, as you probably did guess. See you guys in the next video. Peace.